Jerry Paxton for Gaming Shogun here at CES in Las Vegas. We're here at the Mad Cat Suite at the Hilton, and we've seen a lot of cool things this uh, this past week, but uh, this is by far the coolest so far. We're, we're here with Alex Very, their global PR manager, and um, he's going to show us something that I think you'll enjoy. Hi, Alex. How are you doing? I'm doing very well. Thank you very much. And I love that intro. One of the coolest things we've seen here at CES. That's pretty I, I, cool. I'm maybe front-loading the hype, but oh, I don't think it's so. a surprise, but you guys will oh, like Oh, I don't think so. So we're here today to talk about the uh, X65 uh, Pro Flight system. It's, uh, it's our SciTech Pro Flight X65F, and uh, it's a HOTAS system, hands-on throttle and stick. Uh, so it's actually a kit, so you've got your joystick, and you've also got your uh, split-level throttle system. Now, what's really cool about this is that it's a world's first. It's a revolutionary force sensing system. It's the first commercially available uh, joystick to feature force sensing. Now, now yeah, when you say force sensing, um, clarify that exactly. What sure, well, lots of people are aware of force feedback, right? But that's already been done and dusted. So force sensing is a technology that's used in F-16 airplanes, okay? So it's based on F-16 technology. So the stick itself doesn't move. The stick itself remains in a rigid position, but it's got sensors under underneath this all metal body which actually pick up the amount of pressure you're applying to the stick at any one time and translates that to an in-game action. So it actually makes for a far, far more precise gaming uh, than, than a stick that actually moves and there's far less fatigue on the player as well. So once you adjust to force sensing you can pull off maneuvers that you could never do with a regular joystick before. It's kind of like voodoo but it's very cool, Jerry. You've actually got holes on the actual stick itself so you can actually mount it directly to a table. Wow. Uh, if you're a serious uh, pro flight enthusiast you can actually mount it to your own rig so the stick remains completely solid at all times and it's got an all metal construction on board as well uh, the split the split level throttle has got over 70 programmable buttons and actions uh, so you've got full d-pad control you've got your trim adjustability as well and you can actually extend the system and it's, it's meant to be expandable and extendable because we also sell the pro flight instrument panel well now you, you uh, we may expand can we uh, let's take a look at it here and we can, sure. we can show exactly what sure we're, we're talking about here. Uh, and the stick isn't moving at all it's so the stick's really not moving at all, yeah. So I don't know how, how interesting that's going to look on camera until we actually get up in the air. Let's get some speed up here. Okay, so you can see that I'm pulling up and the actual plane is taking off, but the stick isn't moving, so I'm controlling that completely by applying pressure onto the stick. And there you go, I've crashed rather spectacularly, but that's because I'm, I'm not paying much attention. So if you're used to flying games, you shouldn't have any trouble at all. There is a learning curve over it, but you can adjust your sensitivity in-game as well. So it actually ships with a whole system of software that allows you to set your sensitivity. So you can actually make the force sensing capabilities as sensitive or desensitive as you wish to react to your individual style of play. Now, out of the box, it's great with uh, with Flight Sim X, which we're, which we're demoing today, but of course it's great with games like Hawks as well, Blazing Angel, so it's not just Flight Sims, but it's uh, Flight Action Games or Combat Games, actually works perfectly with as well. Now, uh, this uh, LCD panel, you said this is what's expandable, this part doesn't come with the Yeah, unit? that's right, so, so the part on the left actually does come with it, but it ships out of the box with this little boilerplate, so that's part of the X65, but we've replaced this at the moment with our Pro Flight Instrument Panel. So what this is doing is taking the, uh, the real-time information provided by Flight Sim X and it's actually displaying it on your screen. Now you can actually buy up to six of these and you can actually mount them right up and that will give you all of your dials, it will give you all of your uh, information taken directly from the game just like a, a real cockpit would have in a plane. The other Pro Flight peripherals, the other consoles that you guys have, will yeah. they be able to interface with this too, or is this just? Yeah, for the no, a absolutely. You can keep going and going. So you can actually uh, you can add on your uh, your radio panel as well. You can add on your multi panel. So depending on on what level of enthusiast you are, you can just keep growing and growing. And that's the neat thing about the system. It's expandable and it grows with yourself as well. Now we're going to get on and, and play it here for a little bit. Please, but yeah. when, when will this be available? So this is going to be shipping in February. Uh, currently stated for three nine nine. So you know it's. it's it's not a cheap product, but it's all metal construction. Uh, it's great value for money, and it's absolutely a world-first product.